you feel um oh dang it i forgot my water hey guys what's up and we are going to where are we going nova Where are we going? <laughs> Whose house are we going to? Grandma. Grandma's house. Yes, we are on my way to my mom's house. I figured um, this is a perfect time to start the vlog. It's 11.20 right now, and um, we're all going to stay the night over there and have a blast, so let's go. You already know what time it is. Is that a good man? Oh. You look so cute. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Hi, TJ. Hi. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Hi. Oh, okay, okay. TJ, you smell like poop. Did you go poo poo? This monster sitting there in front of you. Blue, get up and get you. When I was here last year for my birthday, you guys remember how I got pulled over by that cop and then he didn't give me a ticket because he said it was so close to my birthday? Uh -huh. I was thinking, I was like, man, I hope I don't get pulled over today. Because they be oh. flying on the freeway. Karen. <laughs> He's dark with you. Oh yeah. Oh, you know the camera. You know, you know about the camera. Is that, is that what the deal is? You know what the camera does. There you go. DJ, say hi. Oh, you know he loves the camera. Yeah. Um, this coffee is brought to you today by Nova, who did not sleep. Nova, why didn't you go to bed last night? Jeez. Mom, what did she just do? Did she just bang herself? The only person who did sleep good was TJ, kinda. And he slept in the room with me, but I discovered that TJ does this thing where he like grunts in his sleep, so he goes <laughs> Like <laughs> TJ, why do you grunt in your sleep? Huh? <laughs> Okay. Blue, did you teach the baby how to grunt? Blue, blue, smile. Say cheese. Cheese. Okay, so I honestly can't remember the last time I left you guys. I think I was at my parents' house, but today is Friday, the 13th in 2020. How are we feeling so far about Friday the 13th in 2020? Well, so far it only took an hour to get from Cookville to Harvard. Yeah, so the power went out, which was great because I had a tattoo appointment scheduled today. A tattoo that I have been wanting to get for years literally needing to get it long overdue gets at the tattoo appointment the tattoo artist tells me he's like we should probably reschedule this because i'm pretty sure we're gonna lose power and i'm like uh -uh, we're gonna do this tattoo so he draws it out li literally the moment he walks back with a picture the power goes out so i have to reschedule and i'm like well i'm gonna go and get a pedicure because again i don't have my kids until monday and i drive through town and all of the power's out. So the power is out island wide. This was like three hours ago. So now we are driving to get off island so that we can go and get food because my dumb self, I didn't eat anything because I was like, well, I don't want to eat before I get a tattoo because, you know, I don't know what's going to happen or how my body will react because it's been so many years since I've gotten a tattoo. And uh, yeah, so now we're just on a mission to find food. First location at the local grocery store was a no-go. The deli was out. Their generator is not very big, so it doesn't like work on many things. It just like saves the food, basically. So, we are hoping we can find something to eat off island, or we're hoping that we can even get off island. So, here we go, wish us luck. We found food! Yay! We found food, we found food. Thank you for this day, thank you for this life, thank you for family, friends, and loved ones, thank you for everything you've given us today, thank you for the warm car, warm food, warm hearts that you've given us. 
pray for all of Woodby Island that they may just be safe during this time and pray for all the electrical power outages and all the homes, people, families, as well as businesses and all the people who are working to take care of the electrical problem. Thank you for everything you're praying. We bless this man in the name of Jesus Christ, your person, the Savior, we pray. Amen. 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 Oh my gosh, they've got two of my favorite places right by each other. Let's go. The wonders of life got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy. Standing up close by the Christmas tree, glimmering light, I am right where I want to be. I'll be home for a couple of days Wander around with you You and me in the cold Thought it'd never be true Wherever I go, I got you Oh, I have stopped running There is no way trying You better loosen your belts Drinking hot wine by the fire Don't care of anything Christmas and some kind of love, my friend. I pray it will never end. Do you like to be here too? It's Christmas. Today has been a hellacious, hellacious day. I can't even believe how long we just went without having power. We literally just spent an ungodly amount of money on a generator only to come home and have our freaking power come on the moment we take the generator out of the box. After going 12 hours without power, it's been a day. It's been a day. It is a Saturday night now and we're getting ready to go out to dinner. I just got dressed in this really um, cute little... What is this, babe? Do you think this is snakeskin? It's like snakeskin bodysuit. I just got this from Forever 21, and then I have on these pants that I picked up from Amazon. I'll try and show you guys a better shot. Can you yes, yes. These pants are so freaking cute. So anyways, yesterday was really, really crazy. We got home super late. The power came back on. It was like a whole event, you guys. I was so frustrated, but today is a new day. I slept in today. I edited a video, which will be up before this one, so you guys have probably already seen it. It was just a clean with me, and now I am getting ready to open up my present from Taylor. So. And what's in here? It's a big box. Take the box outside of the box. Oh, okay. <laughs> smells like paint. It, oh, is, okay. it is upside down. Oh, okay. The most massive bowl ever. It's huge, okay. Okay, so I didn't know that you could do this, but I figured why not ask me and Taylor really like getting Oreo blizzards from Dairy Queen, which is where we are right now. And how did we order it this time? Extra Oreos. Extra Oreos. There's no other way to do it. I'm going to regret this next week. I ain't perfect, but I'm worth it. Yeah, you working on me. All right, you guys, so we just got back from doing all of our Christmas shopping. Well, actually, we went Christmas shopping yesterday and we went to Home Goods and we went to the Dollar Tree. So I thought that it would be really neat if I showed you guys everything that we picked up that's new this year for decorating for Christmas because we are going to be doing that tomorrow and I will be having a Christmas clean and decorate with me. So make sure that you're subscribed so that you don't miss that. But let me show you what we got. So I picked up a few new ornaments. So I'm just gonna run through you really quickly. So we did pick up uh, the theme this year is going to be a frozen theme so I picked up this Robert Stanley whoops 
brand of bulbs and these are so beautiful. I really loved the blue and the snowflake detail on these and there was 14 pieces. Everything that was Christmas at HomeGoods was 50% off. So these were $15, a dollar a bulb. I thought that was pretty good. The main bulbs that we're gonna have for our tree this year are the blue, clear, and sparkly. It's going to be a frozen theme and that's because my daughter's birthday is on November 26th and she wants a frozen themed birthday so we're doing a frozen themed Thanksgiving and then I felt like the theme would really tie into a frozen themed Christmas this year and it's also nice because we did get an artificial flocked tree from Walmart. Everything that I can link, I'll try and have linked down below for you guys but we got the infamous $69, six and a half foot pre-lit flocked Christmas tree from Walmart. Such an amazing deal. And I felt like these bulbs and this theme would look absolutely stunning. So I'm really excited for all of the white and all of the pretty glistening Christmas decor that we did pick so up. So I did pick these two trees up for my mantle. Uh, I thought these were really cute and fun and I am gonna hang some little um, mini ornaments on them the plain silver ones I thought were super cute um, and I also picked these up for the mantle as well these are adorable and I feel like I've seen these everywhere this season and I just felt like they're so glam and so beautiful so I'm really excited about that and then I did pick up a few white ornaments so I just got this little tree one with the dangling gem at the end which I thought was really pretty and classy I got the let it snow for you know frozen the snow themed and then I did get this little house this is an LED lighthouse so it does light up and I thought this was really pretty as well and then I just picked up a few of these winter picks so I got this all white one I got this silver one and then I got this mix of greenery and silver one and I got this little tin green thing and the reason why I got these specifically was because I picked up this three-tiered tray and I'm so excited because I'm going to have a Christmas themed three-tiered tray and I'm gonna be decorating that on camera for you guys so you can see how I come up with that I picked up these this artificial snow and then I do have some greenery from last season that I'm gonna to plan to throw in here to and I hope that I make something really cute. Um, I got these stainless steel uh, stocking holders and um, these just go right so if you see how our house is set up we have those two hang um, floating shelves right there so I'm gonna have the hooks like on two on each shelf and we're gonna hang our stockings from there that's what I did last year except last year I used command hooks and it did not work well so I'm hoping that these will work a lot better and be able to hold they're really sturdy and heavy so I'm excited about that so I also picked up two rolls of wrapping paper which again just goes with the theme. I just feel like it's gonna be really nice and classy this year. It's gonna be really beautiful and I love it. The kids are going to get their own colorful trees and fun decorations in their room and in their bathroom because I do like to decorate every room in my house so don't worry about that. Um, this new tree topper was stunning. I had to get it. I felt like it would match our tree so perfectly. And then I did pick up another buffalo check blanket just because they were on sale 50% off and we already have one just like this so now we'll have two for our couch when I change our couch pillow covers for Christmas. So that is everything that I picked up from Home Goods. And let me show you guys the few little pieces that I got from Dollar Tree as well, because I did get a few ornaments from there too. So. so from Dollar Tree, I picked up seven ornaments. And honestly, these were such good deals. I got these really beautiful like snowflake flower renditions. And I just felt like these were so glam. Um, this one, they only had one left, but I had to get it. I felt like it was so pretty. And then I got several of these. I really love the holographic glue. and. It's like a 3D snowflake, which I thought was really, really pretty. I got three of these, and then I got one that's all silver and like more of a massive snowflake, which was really stunning. And these ones were two pieces, and they actually jangle and make little noises. So I got two that are little stars, and then I got two that are little snowflakes. So as you can see, we're gonna have a nice snow frozen themed tree this year. I'm really excited to see how that all turns out. I feel like it's gonna be really pretty. I feel like it's going to be really classy and elegant. That's kind of the theme that I'm going for this year. I just want everything to feel really glamorous, um, just really peaceful in my living room because that's where we spend a lot of our time and I am just so looking forward to decorating for Christmas. So you guys, make sure that you're subscribed and if you're new here, check out one of these videos right here so that you guys can keep on seeing the magic and I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye.